I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please stay tuned for a moment of silence. Good morning, Bears. Welcome to this edition of LC Current. Today is Monday, March 9th, 2020. I'm Monica. And I'm Mackenzie. Your morning announcements start now. Applications are being accepted for students interested in being part of the National Honor Society for the 2020-2021 school year. Students in 10th and 11th grade with a GPA of 3.5 or higher are encouraged to apply. Check out your Canvas dashboard for the application process. Applications will be accepted now through March 21st. If you have any questions, please contact Mr. Shelf in room 177. Our college visits for today are Columbia College Chicago at 9.30 a.m., Seton Hall at 11 a.m., and Butler University at 2.30 p.m. Tomorrow we have DePaul University at 9.30 a.m., Nova Southeastern University at 11 a.m., and Brescia University at 2.30 p.m. Please use your confirmation from Naviance as your pass out of class. Attendance will be taken. The meetings take place in the LGI. There will be a Best Buddies March Club meeting on March 19th in the Large Group Instruction LGI Room in the science hallway from 4 p.m. to 5 p.m. Come for fun. There will be a Best Buddies annual talent show on Friday, March 20th at 6 p.m. that all students and staff are invited to attend. Peer Buddies and Buddies are to report to the LGI room after school at 4 p.m. for the talent show pre-festivities. See you then. For more details, see Rachel Hodge or Dajanae Jones, Ms. Kennard in room 404, or Ms. Northcutt in room 406. All LC students are always welcome to join Best Buddies for friendship and fun anytime. Attention juniors and seniors, tickets for Elsie's 2020 prom, Midnight in Paris, are on sale now in the bookstore. You can purchase your ticket before school, during passing periods, and during the lunch blocks. If you would like a chance to place a song request, you need to buy your ticket before spring break. Attention, if you are a junior or senior looking to bring a guest to prom, guest forms can be found in Miss Leffridge's office. No freshman will be permitted to attend the dance, and sophomores who are invited by an upperclassman will be permitted upon approval by Miss James. Guest forms must be completed, approved, and turned in at the time of ticket purchase. New scholarship available. The Evans Scholarship is full college housing and tuition. Estimated value of $120,000 over four years. If you were a caddy for two summers or more or, and are planning on attending IU or Purdue, you may apply. Cruising committees for Mary Poppins will meet today at 4 p.m. in the auditorium. The countdown is real, and for those of you who don't know, LC Dance Marathon is Sunday. To get into spirit, we host a Riley Week where we do themes and fun activities throughout the week. Today is Pajama Day. We will also be taping our principal to the wall in the comments. Tomorrow is Tacky Tourist or Luau Day. There will be a teacher rap battle in the morning. Wednesday is Jersey Day. This is also Pie Your Teacher in the Face Day. Thursday is LC Spirit Wear, and there will be a mascot dance battle with LN. Finally, next Friday is Red Out for Riley, and there's going to be a cheer pep session. We would love to see your Riley spirit throughout the week. Can't wait to see you at LCDM and always FTK. Today's vocabulary word is oleogenous, an adjective that means resembling or having the properties of oil, oily, also containing or producing oil marked by an offensively aggratiating manner or quality. On this date in 1945, the U.S. executes a firebombing raid over Tokyo. This is regarded as the single most destructive bombing raid in human history, with 16 square miles of central Tokyo destroyed, 267,171 buildings destroyed, an estimated over 100,000 civilians killed, and over 1 million left homeless. Tokyo's industrial output was cut in half due to the bombing. 
The raid consisted of 334 B-29s dropping 1,665 tons of bombs on Tokyo. The first firebombs were dropped to form a large X pattern over Tokyo's working class district. The following planes aimed for this large flaming X. High winds caused the fires to spread quickly and turn into major blazes. American casualties consisted of 96 airmen killed or missing, 6 wounded or injured, and 12 B-29s shot down. This was the highest death toll of any air raid during the war, including Hiroshima and Nagasaki. And in 1959, the first Barbie doll goes on display at the American Toy Fair in New York City. 11 inches tall with a waterfall of blonde hair, Barbie was the first mass-produced toy doll in the United States with adult features. The woman behind Barbie is Ruth Handler, who co-founded Mattel Inc. with her husband in 1945. After seeing her young daughter ignore her baby dolls to play make-believe with paper dolls of adult women, Handler realized there was an important niche in the market for a toy that allowed little girls to imagine the future. Handler named the doll after her daughter, Barbara. Celebrity birthdays. Bow Wow is 33. Britney Snow is 34. Oscar Isaac is 41. And Emmanuel Lewis is 49. This has been today's Current. Enjoy, Enjoy your week, Elsie! Dream.